hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new guys welcome welcome my name is maria if you are one of my subscribers guys welcome well guys today's video is a bit different um just gonna give you a little bit of a heads up guys when i was recording for some reason my sd card was giving me um, a hard time i don't know if it was the sd card or the camera it kept um cutting um my video so i ended up it didn't record none of the eye makeup look that i did so i ended up recording um the entire face so on the video you do gonna see i'm gonna finish one of my eyes and then i'm gonna continue with the whole f um face i do apologize hopefully by next week i can upgrade to a new sd card i'm assuming it's the sd card but I'm crossing my fingers on that one well guys if you definitely want to see how i at least finish my uh, makeup continue watching um if you want to be a part of the family all you have to do is just comment subscribe and share my videos remember to hit that notification bell so like that you can be posted bye guys see you on the next one bye hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome if you're one of my subscriber welcomes well guys as you can see i already have my eye makeup done for some reason i was having an issue with my camera or my sd card like i said in my intro so i'm just going to show you here very briefly um the items that i use just to prep my skin i use my calendula cream i use a serum from boxy charm also, I ended up using my primer from BoxyCharm, also the No More Prime, I think that's what it's called. Um, and also, I am using my Age Revias from my under eye, um, for my fine lines. So, the palette that I'm going to be showing you guys is a palette. Okay, so I show you here again the syrup. So the palette that I'm going to be showing you, it's a palette that came from BoxyCharm. It's from Dominique Cosmetics, the Celeste um, Thunder Palette. I really love this palette a lot, guys. It's very pigmented. I like it so much, guys, that I barely don't even use it as much. So I'm showing you the colors um, that I use. So the blue color I use it has a transition. The gray color I use it for my crease. The darker gray I used it for my to darken up the crease. The very um, light glittery color that the um, eye makeup look that I'm using on the lid, and the orange color that I kind of showed that's going to be my highlight for my inner um, for my inner eyes. Okay guys, so this is the part right here that I'm showing you that I kind of completed um, my last eye, I guess. So I'm just adding a little bit of the highlight to my brown bone. And the palette that I'm using, you already know it's one of my favorite ones. It's from Coven Girl. It's the French Vanilla one. So right here guys, I am going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in Yellow. I'm going to cover and color correct my under eye circles. Yeah, so you already know this is also one of my holy grails. I always like that brightness underneath my eyes. I like my eyes to um, look sort of that I'm always awake and not tired. Um, but yeah, so right here, I'm just going to be um, putting a little bit today. Um, and I'm going to blend it in with the finger. And then I'm going to go in with the beauty sponge and blend it out. 
um so on this part right here guys i am also gonna go in with my um, foundation and the foundation that i'm going in guys it's with the vfx foundation and it's in number zero four so i'm gonna be putting that all over it and i'm gonna go back and blend it in with the beauty sponge Okay, so right here guys, I'm going in with my L'Oreal Concealer. Um, I no longer have the um, pharmacy. I gotta go back and repurchase some of their concealers again. So right here, I'm using the one in Ivory. Um, so I'm just gonna do a little bit of highlight with it. Um, and I'm just gonna go back in and blend it in with the beauty sponge. Okay guys, so right here to the area that I kind of highlighted, I'm going to go back and set it with a loose um, translucent powder. And the powder that I'm currently using, it's the one from Airspun.
okay guys so here i am showing you a brand new palette that i got last week from pharmacy i'm so excited this is the um, contour palette that they have the, this is in the powder one um yeah every time i try to purchase this they were always out of stock but i finally got it um so the colors that i i'm using i'm only using one so the palette does have three it does have like a dark bronzy one and it does have a, a bronze a bronzer and the highlight or to set the high um the areas that i kind of highlighted so on the palette i'm just going in with a darker color just to um contour and give color into the areas of my skin as you can see guys, this issue that I was having with my camera, I totally forgot to remove my translucent powder. But yeah, don't worry guys, I'm going to go back and remove all that. As you can see, I'm just going back and removing the powder. I don't know if I did mention guys, um, I think I forgot to show also. So the highlight that I am currently using, it's um, one of my favorite ones from Pharmacy. This one is the Terracotta Highlight. These are the single um, highlights that they have. So right here guys, I'm going in with my Pharmacy Eyeliner. These are the retractable eyeliners that Pharmacy has. So I'm just going to go in and tight line my eyes. So I'm just going to be prepping my under eyelids for my um, eyelashes. So now what I'm going to go do is I'm going to use a sort of like a nude brown color. And I'm going to be putting that into my water lines. Okay guys, so what I'm going to be doing here now is I'm going to go into my lower lashes and I'm going to be doing the same thing that I just did on my crease. I'm going to be using my transition color. Um, also, I'm going to be using my crease color. So the transition color guys is that blue um, sort of turquoise color. And then I'm going to go in with my crease color. It's that gray color on the palette. And then I'm going to go in and deepen up the crease a little bit more for a little bit more definition. And I'm going to be using that sort of dark gray on the palette. It does have some type of shimmer in it also, guys. Um, if you do have the palette or if you look at the palette, it does have sort of like a... I'm gonna see like a purpley a sparkle in it.
okay guys here on the same palette i have decided to put sort of like a pop of color um and i'm gonna go in with that um glittery orange on the palette and i'm gonna be using that just to highlight my inner corners Okay guys, so right here I am going in with my uh, mascara. It's a 3D mascara also from Pharmacy. So as you already can see, I already have my eye lashes already done. And I do have my eyeliner already done also. Okay guys, so right here I'm going in with my brow gel from Pharmacy. Just setting my um, brow hairs in place. Um, also guys, I decided to add a little bit of a sort of like glitter. So I'm using the Pharmacy Metallic Glitter Eyeliners. Um, I don't know, sort of the look was looking sort of kind of dull for me. So I just put the eyeliner on. Um, I didn't show on this part either guys, but I ended up uh, cutting the part or didn't show. I did use my pharmacy um, setting spray also. Well guys, this is basically it for the look. Um, if you definitely want to be part of the family, all you have to do is just um, subscribe, comment, and share my videos and remember to hit that notification bell so like that you can be posted when i do upload a video bye guys see you on the next one